Sanchez. You're not getting out of there alive. Shut up, Danik. Bring it on, asshole. I approve. Yeah. Just dropping off that frame. All right. Bunch of unitologist assholes outside, probably. You ready for this? Mm-hmm. Let's do it. We know this is even gonna work. Did you find out how they make a codex from all this? Yeah. It looks like they use magnetomic forensic neurology, which produces the data stream stored in the codex. It's like they lifted the codes of the machine right out of her brain. Well, that sounds familiar. At least I didn't poke her eye out. I'll be there soon. Yep, I see what you did there. Let's go to the garbage area. Oh boy. It's a bit like the sewer level. It could suck. Wait, have we been through a sewer level yet? The very beginning. Very well then. Just because I'm curious, what does the compact frame do? Oh, it's for one handed weapons, okay. Suit kiosk. I think my rig is fully upgraded. Everything but Kinesis, but now it's fully upgraded. Hold on, that, suits? that compact frame was really good for my plasma cutter, so I'll, let me just upgrade this really quick. That's fine, I'm, I'm considering different suits. Legionary suit's nice and all, but... You know what? I'm going back. Going back as well? No. Which one are you flipping to? The witness. I've tried the witness suit out on Carver. I'm, it's got to look different, right? Maybe I don't know. Well, they've all looked different for us. Let's both rock the witness. Why not? We we're brothers in insanity. Brothers in dementia. Yeah, you keep that. 
yeah. Look at the eyes on the face. Very well then. Oh, I guess it wants us to go this way. Markers are a sure sign of good things. Aren't they always? <laughs> Colonel J. Gaskell to General S. Mahad, subject disposal. Per your orders, the halls are packed with all of the research papers, biological specimens, and lab equipment we can find. Incinerators are on standby, just waiting for your final command to pull the trigger. Still no sign of Serrano or Rosetta. Maybe they didn't get the dock. Well... <laughs> I should say maybe that um, the general and his cronies didn't get the dock. Something probably did, given the fact that, you know, this place is a hellhole. Scavenger bot's back. Why does it look so gooey in here? I don't know. Alright. I'll do it. Watch my butt. What is 
that? Oh. Got ourselves a bit of a puzzle here, do we? Okay. Do you have a plasma core on the bottom of that? Is that what you got there? No, that's a survey chart. Ah. This place sure has a lot of fucking twists and turns in it. Oh, goody. Yep, just take all the noise back to fuckers. Okay, 
scavenger bots. Actually, it'd probably be a good idea to just drop off some of this shit here. Or sell it. Do you have any bars? Uh... I got one. Okay, I'll make one too. Okay. And I have 60 ration seals. So that means. Oh, yeah, you know what? Let's do that. For those of you following along at home, there's downloadable content so that you can apparently either buy this shit or use your ration seals. Let's see what we get. In other words, fuck buying this. Uh, Mark V directed suspension. Ooh, Mark V stasis amplifier. Mark V conic dispersal. Mark V directed ejection field. Mark V flame gaze. Wow. You have a Mark V flame gaze? Yeah. You wouldn't mind trading that, would you? Can you? Yes, I think you can. How do you do that? I could use that on my gun. I think if you go underneath weapon crafting and you're on the, you know, attachment screen, if you hit R, you should be able to share it. Heart cannot be shared. Ah. Uh. Yeah. Put a Mark V stasis amplifier on the top of my gun, though, so that should help. And then, yeah, should be good to go. Okay, I'm up to 64 rounds. Should work. Sixty-four rounds on top in my rifle, fifteen shotgun rounds on the bottom. That one part I got was the upgraded uh, version of my shotgun, so I use that. Ah, very nice. Let's roll. Text log. 
see what we got here. First contact scenarios. One, no danger of infection or contagion. Two, moderate danger of infection uh, or contagion. Standardize, uh, standard sterilization procedures require. I can't talk. Three, localized outbreak. Infected personnel to be quarantined. Four, virulent outbreak. Destruction of site and all associated personnel required. Five, extinction level outbreak. Extreme containment procedures required. All personnel participating and associated with or with knowledge of the outbreak site must be destroyed. All locations, connections to said personnel <laughs> to be destroyed. Where destruction is impossible, permanent containment is required. Christ. Well. So I guess that explains what the hell Serrano was doing. I mean, Mahad. Well, excuse me, Mahad, yes. Oh, why did I pick that up? Full zoom scope, huh? Goddamn bench when you need one. There was one right back there. Back where? No, 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 no. Let's just let's just keep going. Really? What the hell, dude? It's the elevator twitch. This is the elevator twitch! You are acting like a bitch! Hey. down there. Okay then. What do we have here? A lot of old computer terminals. Okay, I guess we're going this way. Coming? Editing something really quick. Not a problem. I'm done though. Let's see if this makes a difference. Yes, it does. Whoa. Tell me how much rate of fucking fire do you have on that thing? Full damage, full rate of fire. Alright, text log. <laughs> From GOA Amboris Kaiden to General Spencer Mahad, Subject Scenario 5. After receiving your reports on Dr. Serrano's latest discoveries and in light of recent activities at the marker test sites, it is the decision of the Council to invoke Scenario 5. What we once thought would have saved us from extinction has only served to hasten it. Everything about the markers, all research, all replicas, even the black marker, must be forever 
What? Even the black marker must be forever buried. There's a black marker here? Oh, I'm Christ. thinking that they're talking about all markers, even the ones back on Earth. <laughs> all sites are to be shuttered, all involved planets are to be blacklisted, everyone involved in the marker program from Aspera to Aegis uh, 7 to Tau Volantis are to be executed. Gotcha. Yeah, they just fucking totally scrapped the entire fucking marker program. That's why 200 years later, they're like, what is this fucking artifact on Aegis 7? And okay. then... Yeah, because it was a blacklisted yeah. planet, they weren't supposed to go there. We realize this will effectively negate our ability to fight the war against the Separatists. They will no doubt take power and form an Earth government in the vacuum we leave behind. But to save the future of mankind, this must come to pass. Should even one person, ship, or scrap of paper survive to make its way into their hands, the epidemic will begin anew and our sacrifice will have been for nothing. I know I can count on you to carry out these orders. It has been a pleasure working with you for these many years. Long live the colonies. Uh, I'm sorry, but destroying everything and only blacklisting places? Bad idea. Bad fucking idea. Well, they were in the middle of a war. It's not like they had a whole hell of a lot of time. Alright. Uh, I better know what's gonna happen. In before hordes? Yeah, see? Some bit. Artifact. Let's see here. Finding Tal Volantis. Tal Volantis was discovered after intense study of the red markers, the man made copies based on the original alien artifact. The copies. Oh, I'm sorry, the black marker. The red marker sequestered safely away on distant star systems. 
such as Aegis 7, Espera, and Proxima Centauri, amongst others, uh, were themselves a mystery, as they were more grown than built. As the red markers were studied, it became clear that they were receiving the signal they broadcast, rather than creating it themselves. The Ptolemy array was built specifically to triangulate the distant signal using the three red markers. They located the source, and it proved to be the most distant point ever reached by man, Tau Volantis, here in the previously uncharted arm of the galaxy. This feat of science and technology will hopefully reward mankind with the ultimate prize, the limitless energy that seems to emanate from the markers, the source of which we expect to find there. Wrong! <laughs> So, basically, at one point in time, somewhere there in the vast reaches of space just went, Come hither! And that's pretty much what happened. Great. What is an ammo sweeper? You can pick the ball ammo without you having to if it's near you. Wow. Hey, man. I kind of want to look into that. Back to the bench.